honeys. How's your day going so far? Mine is going fine. It's 521 here p.m. I'm making a pot of chili and I'm actually cooking on my stove. Okay, so I got the meat going. Let me let this down. Still too tall. Let's see if I can angle this. Walk down here some potatoes. Boiling on the stove. He gonna fix a steak. I gotta use this ground beef up. So, make it chilly. Show y'all. And I never seasoned my ground beef until after it's done. So this is pretty lean chili, so I'm not gonna have to drain anything. I'm using my time and table cookware. And I have one fault with it. I wish they had made the handles uh, that don't get hot. So only thing I don't like about that. Ground beef is almost done. I trained myself to cook on the back burner. I'm going to bring it to the front. Since I'm filming. Turn this on. Raising little kids, and you're supposed to train yourself to cook on the back burner so the kids don't reach up and pull a pot over or touch the flame or even with the uh, electric stove. That pretty red glow on the stove, it looks nice to little kids and enticing. Make them want to touch it. Chili is one of the quickest and easiest things you can fix. And I love it. And I like a lot of beans in my chili. Some people don't put beans in their chili. Just a minute. Okay. Time to add the ingredients to the chili. I'm going to season it. There's no seasoning in here. And I don't chop up nothing. Like uh, onion and bell pepper and stuff. Like most people do. Okay, I'm gonna dump my beans in here. I'm using light red kidney beans. You can buy the uh, chili beans if you want, so it has a thicker sauce. So I'm using three cans because I like a lot of beans. And here's some are these light red? And these are also it's another brand, light red kidney beans. I'm gonna get all this goodness out of here. Got the cans. I usually mix the light red and the dark red kidney beans. Okay, I'm going to add some thick and chunky salsa. This has everything in it. The bell pepper, the jalapenos, uh, onions, everything that you would normally chop up in your chili is in here. I'm putting the whole jar. This is a lot. And I got about two and a half pounds of ground beef in here. Okay, what else I need? I'm gonna add some crushed red pepper, red pepper flakes. Add some black pepper. Onion powder, granulated onion. Put 
No salt and none of this stuff. Granulated garlic, a little bit. What else I got? What's this? Uh, what's this here sauce? I'll put it in this spray, this oil sprayer. Okay, it don't want to come out. There you go. I need to refill it. Stir it up. Starting to smell good already. So if I put the seasoning in here. Oh wow. I didn't put the chili mix in here yet. I'm gonna add two packs of chili on mix. Didn't add any extra salt. So whatever salt was in the uh, salsa and whatever salt that's in this chili mix, chili seasoning mix. If you don't have this, if you got taco mix, you can add that. It works. The two packs. And you usually have to use liquid when you add them seasoning packets in here. Let me see if I got some chicken broth. I hope I got some. Yeah, here it is. Chicken broth. Get this goodness out of this jar. Put the top on it. Try to shake it. Goodness out these cans. I don't like to waste Always keep the bag nearby while I'm cooking so I can clean up. Put all this in here. Okay. Just a little bit of that left. What it need? It needs something. I don't know. No more garlic. Onion. Black pepper. Let me put some hot sauce in it. It needs something. I'm not sure what. Put some French red hot hot sauce up in here. 
And it's not gonna make it hot. I'm not gonna, I'm trying to make it hot. So I can do that in my bowl. I just want to add a little oomph. I want to get it just right, and then I'm going to uh, let it simmer. That's good. Mm -mm -mm. A little hot sauce. It's moist to see. This ain't spraying. Maybe it's too low because it needs to be refilled. Okay. Or what's this here sauce? Tastes right. So let it simmer for a couple minutes. I'm gonna clean up this mess, and I will be back. Okay. It's been simmering. Mm. Get me up a bowl full. Usually I put oyster crackers in here. I'm gonna have a slice of bread. Let me take this off here so I can get a thumbnail. Okay. Chili. It has bell pepper. It has jalapenos chopped up in it from the salsa. It has onions. Okay, I need a good thumbnail. Good. I'm going to dip this up, turn the fire off. I'm using my pretty woman, Pioneer Woman, soup and chili mug. Got it from Walmart a while ago. It was on sale. I think it was under five dollars. And this was the only one they had. So of course I had to grab it. I like a lot of juice in my chili. I'm gonna clean this cup off because it looks disgusting. Okay. 
Okay, y'all, I want to thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up, leave a nice comment, and subscribe to my channel. Y'all know this is piping hot. <laughs> y'all see that steam? Try to taste a little. It's moisturizing my face. Yeah, the steam treatment. Dip this bread in this juice. Sop it. Okay, well, thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up, leave a nice comment, and subscribe to my channel. It's 5.44 now. You all be blessed. Stay safe. And bon appetit. Bye.